Hey guys, this is Private A Rock, and we are back with probably one of the biggest sneak peeks of this update. And to begin, this is going to be a pretty short one. It's it's only two things, but it's two major things. So let's get right into it. The first thing is going to be the Inferno Dragon. The Inferno Dragon is a super troop version of the Baby Dragon. It's equipped with a mobile Inferno Tower on his back, just like the single mode Inferno. If you guys played Clash Royale, I'm sure you would recognize this. Um, he costs 60,000 Dark Elixir to create, so 60,000 to upgrade the Baby Dragon to the super troop Inferno Dragon. So the Inferno Dragon's beam attack starts at 80 DPS and it increases the longer it shoots up to 1600 DPS. That's a crazy amount of damage and this will be very very useful on things such as the clan castle or maybe even a max level king or queen if they're not already shooting at this guy. Uh, he has a housing space of 15, its range is 4 tiles. And I already said its upgrade cost is 60,000 Dark Elixir. Its HP is 2100, and it will cost 16,500 Elixir to train with a 2 minute and 15 second training time. Honestly, that's really not that bad. So this next troop, I don't know exactly how it's going to be played, but I could see it being used as a great support troop, and you'll see why. The Super Witch is the new troop. It's obviously it's upgraded from the Witch. Witch to the Super Witch, very creative name selection. Uh, the Super Witch is a brand new addition to the Super Troop roster, where the Witch summons a small batch of skeletons. The normal Witch summons a small batch of skeletons. The Night Witch summons bats. The Super Witch summons one thing, and it's called the Big Boy. The Big Boy is a giant skeleton with almost as many hit points as a super giant. This thing is crazy, and here's the thing, is when it dies, it still will spawn another one. So it's not like it's a one and done. It'll spawn one. If that one dies, it will spawn another. So as long as this Super Witch is being supported with plenty of other troops, so the Super Witch is in the back, let's just say you have golems in front or something like that, this could be a very, very effective attack strategy. However, the Super Witch is a pretty good troop by herself. She does 360 DPS, which is essentially double the damage of a current max level witch without the super upgrade however it is a very very big troop in terms of housing space because she has 40 housing space cost which is a lot her range is also four tiles as i said before she summons the big boy uh, and her upgrade cost is 60,000 dark elixir same as the inferno dragon she has 3200 hit points which is great she costs 915 dark elixir to train and she takes 10 minutes to train one the big boy stats on the other hand uh has 350 dps and 4100 hit points so the big boy does almost as much damage as one hit from the night witch and has more health so overall that's crazy i think this is going to be fantastic I will try as get as, and get as much footage as I can so that you guys can see these in action if I can get any video, otherwise it'll just be pictures. But hey, you can see what's going on at least and get excited for the next update because this is going to be great. Apparently there's one more sneak peek coming up tomorrow, so hope you guys stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been Private A Rock. I hope you all have a fantastic day and I will see you guys later. Peace out. I know you're a monster.